Welcome back to Centerwell uh, Senior Primary Care. We continue our tour um, with CMO Dr. Erica Savage Jeter once again. We've stepped in kind of into one of the exam rooms, and this is really the heart and soul of where um, that extraordinary care, right, and your, your wonderful care team really takes place in here. Absolutely. So again, our centers are designed keeping our seniors in mind, and so we have these spacious exam rooms so that we have the room to have conversations with patients and their family members if mm -hmm. they choose to bring them along with them. And so we come here, like you said, this is where the magic happens. And so on that first visit, it's really about understanding the patient. Mm -hmm. So we want to know if there are any conditions that trouble them, you know, where they are in terms of managing those and how we can assist. So we spent most of that visit doing just that. And in doing that, we also look to see if there are any barriers, if there's anything that's preventing them from being at the best healthy state. And so if we if we sense anything that, you know, where there's a barrier, we then also incorporate the, the use of our care team in their management. And so our care team is it's the heart of our centers. You know, it includes not just our physicians, our nurse practitioners, our medical assistants, but also our our, our nurses, our um, transition of care nurses, our care coach nurses that really help carry the message around how do we stay healthy, what do we need to do to manage any conditions that we have. Our social workers are so important because a lot of times our seniors are on fixed incomes. They have needs that they're unable to, you know, uh, to fix on their own. They need someone to help, they need that support. And then there are our behavioral health specialists and our pharmacists also involved in the care, looking for barriers, looking for ways to educate, all in attempts to help our patients get to healthier states. What I was so impressed with is just understanding kind of there's an area just off from this exam room where the care team can meet and discuss things like, you know, so-and-so's coming in and you know that they're experiencing a food insecurity. I mean, those things matter. I wish like the world would behave like the care team sure. that it's just beyond again just giving you a prescription and sending you on your way mm -hmm. or this person may be experiencing depression or sadness because of something that personally has happened in their yes. life so every morning starts with a huddle we get together prior to patients showing up and we do just what you yeah. just suggested we run through our patients we talk about things that we know of in terms of any uh, care gaps or anything that they need and then we say well let's pay attention to this and mm -hmm. let's make sure we ask about this again so we can understand understand our patients people are complex in general yeah. and so we just want to understand all the complexities that factor into their health because if we don't address those things we will certainly not help them get to a healthier state yeah, I want to show off the state-of-the-art oh, room yeah. yeah you have like even the can you hit the pedals on the, yeah. the chair there it's yeah. really it's, it's great I think this is wonderful to so show up these right? are called brewer chairs again <laughs> we do this we keep our seniors in mind yeah. if you go in most exam rooms there's a, a large exam table that most seniors cannot sit on right, right? they cannot navigate yeah. There. So we have these brewer chairs that start off at the same level as a regular chair and then we're able to elevate that so that we can examine them. And then it converts into a table. So it lays back um, so that, let's see. You're taking them on a ride yeah, right now. Yeah. Yep. And then it, these things will come out so that we can get closer to them. That. Yeah. Oh, so that. again, it's all designed so that we can, you know, manage the patient, take care of them, make sure that we have things that they can easily access and use. Just keeping them in mind, keeping our patients in mind. And uh, we want to remind everybody the types of insurance that you accept. Absolutely. So we accept Humana, we accept Anthem, we accept WellCare, and we accept Aetna, and then Medicare, just traditional Medicare as well. Well, thank you so much for showing us around. Uh, your entire team really took care of us this morning, showed us all around. Big celebration uh, tomorrow, 10 to 1, and you want everybody to come out and check it out. Absolutely. We're so we're so appreciative that you guys came to spend the morning with us and we hope we see everybody in the community here tomorrow as we celebrate our grand opening all right get the tour and ride the chair <laughs> do some bingo yeah. and listen to the dj yeah. but that's happening uh tomorrow 10 to 1 we are at south second street we are nestled uh right next to kroger starbucks uh churchill downs is in front of us you know papa john uh, not papa john uh, cardinal stadium is over on the side i caught myself there uh but it's a really great central location as well want to mention that they have another location off of outer loop and another location coming that we're hopefully get to catch up with you about again uh, that's going to happen near Norton sports and learning complex that's right right that's, that's right mm -hmm. West that's Louisville. Louisville. yes mm -hmm. all right so stay with us we're going to wrap things up from right here at Centerwell senior primary care stay with us